Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Fast Electronic Live, bringing to you Fast Electronic. And of course, uh, my name is Ryan Rigg, and today is What Is In My Bags Tour. So actually, instead of What Is In My Bag, unfortunately, it's What Is In My Bags. There is two of them. Uh, if you didn't know, Team Fell is actually headed to Chicago this weekend for the Chicago Auto Show. So make sure you subscribe to our channel as we're going to bring you a lot of videos and content from that show as we'll be there. So what I want to do here is just uh, start from left to right here, and we'll go uh, over what's in my bags. So... Starting from left to right here at the top, what we got here is that it's nice to have, you know, a surge protector. You know, when you travel, outlets are definitely at a uh, minimum in hotels, as well as you never know the quality of that voltage. So it's good to have, you know, nice power protection, as well as give yourself some extra power ports. So I also keep a, a couple of chargers here. These are for my MacBook Pro Retina displays. I keep a... Uh, there's my uh, 2013 and 2012. The 2012 has got the i7 8 gig RAM and the GT650 M1 gig video. And the newest one I have is the 2013. That's got the uh, i7 quad core. It's got 16 gig RAM and it does feature that GT750 M2 gig video. That's their top of the line 15.4 inch retina display. That's my new uh, workhorse for rendering. Uh, do a lot of the videos on that. So I'm actually shooting this with the iPhone 5S. So that's what's actually missing from the setup here. And I keep also, this is actually really handy to have this is the Thunderbolt to Ethernet adapter. Makes to have a nice uh, connection there. You just uh, plug that in on the Mac here on the side. Oh, pardon me, it's on the other side because I've got them turned around so the Apple logo is looking at you. These just plug into your Thunderbolt port there, provide you an Ethernet connection. Real simple, nice to have. Uh, in addition, I also keep Airport Express, a base station. It's nice to sometimes create that Ethernet connection and or share. You know, if there's only a wired connection, then we can create a, a wireless one as long as a router doesn't detect us. So I keep a, uh, this is a 32 gig iPad Air Silver, and I keep an iPad Mini uh, 16 gig with Retina display. Yeah, I'm kind of partial to the white devices there. I've got a, uh, along for the ride, a uh, Blue Yeti. Do a lot of the voiceover at that. That way I can get a good clean audio. And this uh, is kind of heavy, but it does travel pretty well. So I got a little... Uh, container I put that in that you know kind of like a shell to keep everything safe in there so I keep an extra charger here for the iPads I've got some extra cables that are also in my bag a couple extra adapters just depending on if I need them you know for here I've got extender cables there uh, moving on I keep a pair of uh, monster DNA these are the tuxedo white good to have listen to music or when I'm editing or rendering or just need some quiet time good to have uh, work well enough for me great sound also keep a My Passport. This is a 1.5 terabyte. Does feature USB 3.0, so it's good to have real fast connection there. Uh, moving on here, I've got the uh, Canon. This is for my Canon 60D. This is the charger and a couple of batteries. And I keep a. Uh, I've got actually a 64 gig card now in the camera, but I got a couple 16 gigs as well as a 32 gig here as well. It's good to also have just a flash drive in case I need that. That's just uh, SanDisk 8 gig cruiser. And then it's good to have also a little flash eye. This is a little tactical one, LED. Pretty bright. Ah, pretty bright. So nice to have. You never know when you need a flashlight. You guys have probably seen this before in a few unboxings. I do keep it when I travel in my bag. Not, I mean, depends where I go. If I'm obviously getting on a plane, I can't take this. But if it's, you know, vehicle travel or just, you know, going somewhere, it's good to have a knife in case you need to cut, you know, zip ties or plastic packaging. Keep a couple extra batteries because I do use the Rode Video Mic Pro. I use that on top of my Canon uh, 60D. So that's how I actually get most of my uh, outstanding audio. So shout out to Rode Microphones there. And I've got uh, my Canon lens that came with that. It's a kit lens. That's the 18 to 135 millimeter. I've also got here the Canon 40 millimeter. They call it a pancake lens. And I've got my 50 millimeter that's just not here. I've got. Uh, it's on order, so we'll get that. Uh, they had to s s clean that and for warranty replace it. So keep a few extra business cards, one for my business, some for YouTube. There's a little mount for my uh, camera. Put that on the DSLR there, and then I can put that on the tripod. So, And I'll put links to everything if you guys want to see all this in the description below. And when I'm traveling, shout out to Citibank and Capital One. I do rock those credit cards, and as you can tell, yes, we are headed to the Chicago Auto Show. And that's the dates, February 8th through 17th at the McCormick Place. That is in Chicago, Illinois. So if you're around there, you know, come see us. So, but yeah, that's kind of what's in my bag here when I travel. So 
The other thing I didn't show you guys here, and uh, I'll open these up here. These are a pair of uh, Oakleys I use uh, all the time when I travel. Unfortunately, I'm kind of very sensitive to light, so these are actually a very special pair of Oakleys to me. So shout out to uh, Soldier Knows Best, a.k.a. Mark Watson. I know you're from St. Louis. Shout out to you, brother. These are actually the official St. Louis Cardinals uh, branded Oakleys. So let me carefully get these out of here. And you can see there they feature the red Oakley. Very sweet. MLB licensed. I love these. These are actually my favorite. And if you look very carefully, I give you try to give you the best angle there. You can see a slight STL logo is embedded on the lens of the glass. So very sweet. I use, uh, wear those all the time. So very nice to have. But yeah, that's kind of uh, what's in my bags. Is uh, you know usually run with all of this all the time iPhone 5s the only thing missing from the mix but I'm actually using that to record this so yeah what's in my bag it's plural <laughs> yeah I'm Ryan Rigg hopefully you guys check us out see some more of our content from the Chicago Auto Show this weekend we'll be there live as well as Fridays with Fell we'll be live tomorrow from downtown Chicago so make sure you guys check that out we'll give you guys a city view of our suite and the city of Chicago downtown so we hope you guys enjoy that and we know we will be there getting as much footage and interviews and everything that we can bring you to Fast Electronic and Loud because that's what we do. We love cars. So, yeah, if you guys uh, like this video and you want to see more like it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. My name is Ryan Rigg, and this has been What's in My Bags. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe, and we'll see you on the next episode. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for Fridays with Fell, live from Chicago, Illinois.